So here's the short list of all my bank stocks. I've got 31 in total. So I just kept a long term graph for each one. 31 in total. Got 17 from the USA. Got four from Ireland. Four from Canada. Four from the UK. And one from the Netherlands. And by the looks of it, most of the US banks pay every quarter. The majority of the Europeans and Irish ones pay annually. I've got one that pays every month. And the yeah, all the UK ones seem to pay semi annually. And for some reason some of them like this I think the stock is in Ireland. But well, that's not an Irish bank. <laughs> So I think it must be uh, the stock itself is Irish on the Irish exchange or, some, or something. I'm not exactly sure. But I found a few cases like that. I was making another list for my Irish dividend stocks and the majority of them are companies that are based well, all over the world. There's only a couple that I have that were both based in Ireland and an Irish company. See this one, that's not Irish. This is the monthly paying bank stock. I tell you, Unibanco. Yeah, it's not too bad of a list, 31. And it'd be interesting to see if uh, any kind of crisis happens or say something like last year, I'd be able to see banks from different countries or all the banks all over the world taking a hit at the same time and then propelling right up not long after it might make things a lot easier for uh, finding discounts if say the banks of a certain country are struggling i can have a look here and see how they're doing compared to banks all over the world Yes, I'll get the longer version of this made as soon as possible. I just have to look up all the rest of the dividend information from them.